Hello, welcome to another edition of Be Your Dad's Beer Reviews. It's the start of my birthday weekend beer. It's, well, beers. There's three of them. Um, so we're starting tonight, Friday, and we are looking at this. And it's a Wonder Beyond beer. It's one of their last releases. Um, or latest releases. And this one is called A Delight in Small Evils. It's a bourbon barrel aged imperial caramel stout and it comes in at a hefty 13% ABV. It says that across the bottom there in gold. Great. Um, best before in this one is 31st of March 2027. It says that in very small writing across the bottom round here. It was canned round about the same time, or canned bottled round about the same time. Um, I think it was just about round about just before Easter. Um, gold wax seal. Um, the label we've got bees with gold bars hanging out of their backside, leaves and a vase of flowers. Have a little look. So it's it's lovely. It's a cracking label. Um, on the back it says this cheeky little uh, this cheeky little potion boasts an irresistible uh, punchy aroma of caramel, followed by geez, that's really small to read. Followed by subtle chocolate and burnt muscovado notes. A slightly slightly thinner body is. Bolstered by a velvety, sil velvety, silky smooth mouthfeel as you enjoy flavours of both caramel and dark, dark roast malts accompanied by hints of honey and dried fig. It says that on the back in there, in very small writing. Um, I know Ben the Beer Lad has done this, he did this last week um, for his birthday. And for those of you who don't know, Ben the is my boy. Um, and he's a basically he's a, he's a week before me in, his, in the old birthday stakes. Um, he loved it. I'm trying to get this wax seal off because me and wax seals don't go hand in hand. That hasn't helped at all. At all. I will keep going. Jeepers. Vaughn creepers. That is thick. Jesus wept. Right, let's see what we do. I've actually that. Don't watch yourselves. I'll be there in a minute. We'll catch it up. I hate wax seals. I understand the reason why you do them. And really, I've said before, I should be doing this, taking the wax seal off before. Ah, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Right, the beer's open. There we go. That's better. Sorry about that. Let's get into a glass. <laughs> oh no! Everything's going wrong. Oh, this is an absolute outrage. No, no, it's going to go. Let's take that off. Anyway, let's go. Here we go. Let's get into a glass. So it's pouring a jet black, dark brown beer. Being a glass, what have we got? I say jet black beer. We've got a no head to speak of. There's a little dusting across the top there, and it's a dark tan. Looks decent. Let's give it a bit of a swirl and see where we go. 
the nose. Ooh. Boozy. Chocolatey, burnt sugary. Oh, booze. Oof. Oh, yeah. It's just it's, it, there's a, a big hit of alcohol in the aroma. You get you get milk chocolate, you get burnt sugars, you get roasted malt. That's good for the budget combination. Cheers. Mmm. Ooh. And that is thinner than I was expecting it to be. <laughs> it's delicious. It's kick ass, but it's delicious. Um I say it's light bodied. Combination is soft. It's decent. Good it's 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 very nice. Go for the big taste, cheers. That's lovely. Stay. It's lovely. It's roasted malt. I get the honey. There's definitely you get honey. I I pick the honey up really well. It's um, roasted malt. It's it's bit of chocolate. It's burnt sugar and it is a honey. There's a, there's definitely honey there. It's and it's lovely. I am um, bit of butterscotch. That's really tasty. Really tasty. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this has been kept in. If it's been kept in any kind of barrel. Of oh, bourbon. Ah, there you go. So the bit, yeah. That that helps it along. Um but that, the honey does come through. The bourbon's there. That's 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 the there's the alcohol vapor straight away. Um I like this. It's, it's very, very tasty. Mrs. Beard's gonna have a crack of this shortly. I um, I think she will probably thoroughly enjoy this. It's certainly a bedtime beer. It's a late night, <laughs> late night in front of the fire, smoking jackets on, get the pipe out, and just have it and, and just swirl it around. Just enjoy it, take your time, just savour it. It's a, it's a beautiful thing. I like this. Normally, Wonder Beyond beers can be really sweet, really chocolatey, really uh, uh, you know, proper diabetes in a bottle. Um, this isn't. This is really well balanced. It's sweet, but it's not too sweet. There's roasted malt, there's bitterness to it, and that helps it along. I, I think if that brings the, the sweetness, just holds the sweetness back a touch. I said the honey, honey comes through for me, the burnt sugar, the mascarado, that certainly comes through. The alcohol is there, the vapour is there, and it's lovely. The back end, you get the, the alcohol again. It's I've got a little tingle here, warming sensation in, in the chops. It's really, really, really good. It's one of the best things that these guys have done in a long time. Yeah, it's a proper sipper of a beer. So I'm going to go away. So this is Wonder Beyond's um, A Delight in small evils, a 13% bourbon battle aged imperial caramel stout, a 13%. Do I like it? Yes. Would I buy it again? Not a shadow of a doubt. Would I recommend to friends? Absolutely, I would. It's glorious. I wish I'd bought two of these to stick one away because this will age like a champ. I think it will be brilliant. In a couple of years' time, but then so it's then that's that's that. Um, if you've had this beer, let me know what you think. Please put a little comment in the comments box below. I'll put a link to the Wonder Beyond website. Dan from Wonder Beyond, he just kind of chips in every now and again. I think he just he releases beers every quarter now. Uh, because it's just a one man gang. Um, so the website may be shut if you say out of stock on all the beers. But if you keep it, if you subscribe to their newsletter, you'll get when it's going to do an episode of releases. Blah, 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 blah. Um, do that for the video. Do that if you don't subscribe down here, the usual stuff. And I'll see you in the next one. Stay there, stay safe. Drink good beer. Hail you.